Welcome to the Hair and Makeup Room. I'm Kari Baus, head of makeup here at HuffPost Live. Today we're talking about bold lips. Here are a few quick techniques I use to get our host's lips looking their best. First, we exfoliate. This prevents the dry cracks in lips which are especially apparent when you work with a bold or dark color. There are plenty of expensive lip exfoliators on the market, but I prefer to make my own using a combination of Aquaphor and white sugar. Mix it up, apply the mixture and let it sit for a couple of minutes so that the Aquaphor can soften your lips. Use your finger to rub in the mix or mash your lips together until the sugar begins to dissolve, at which point you can remove what's left with a tissue. Countless lip colors get returned to stores because they don't look the same on as they do in the tube. And a major reason for this is your own lip color is affecting the hue. So don't return anything before trying a flesh tone lip liner first. And now for the fun stuff, color. Today we're going with a bright pink because Caitlin is not exactly known for embracing subtlety. I do a first round by applying in the middle of both the upper and lower lips and then asking Caitlin to mash her lips together to distribute the color naturally. Then I do a second coat and perfect the lines with a sponge if needed. Okay, Caitlin, you're all done. Now go do your segment on whether or not middle school health classes should be teaching teens how to give better blowjobs. Should be a doozy. That's not going up. Click here for more conversations on life and style.